I guess we'll just do my personal favorite chords and chords that I use the most uh, in my songwriting. Um, keep in mind, I don't know most of the chord names because nobody does. Because like, what what is this supposed to? What is that supposed to be? You know, and then if you just remove that finger, what does that change it to? And you put it there. What I do know are bar chords. I love bar chords. I think they're fun. So we're gonna start with the first bar chord that you're gonna learn ever, probably ever. F. Unless you learn B, which would be weird. Haha. <laughs> okay, so. F is like this. Now, this shape that you're going to be doing with these three fingers is what I call an L shape because it's one and then you go lower and over one, two. So if without it, so. That's an L shape, and that's what I'm going to be calling it. It's not the technical term, if there is one. I don't know. And then so, when you use a finger to cover more than one string, that's called a bar. So, F is bar the first, L shape on the second and third. The way that I play it is, instead of barring, because that's dumb and I didn't learn how to do that until very, like, fairly recently, like two months ago, um, I use my index finger on the fifth and sixth string. And then I do an L shape going, so that's F. And then F minor is you move that finger to cover the fourth, fifth, and sixth, and you lift up the middle, and you go. So that's F. Another chord that I use all the time would probably be C. C is the most common chord. This is the common way to play C. C major is first finger on the first fret, fifth string, uh, second finger on the second fret, third string, and then third finger, third fret, second string. And mute the top string because it doesn't really work. All right, cool. Um, and finally, D. And we're also going to do G. D is special because all the D chords um, mute the top two uh, strings instead of just the top one. It's these two. So you only have four strings. And what you do is on the uh, fourth, fifth, and the sixth, well, yeah, fourth, fifth, and sixth, you go second, third, second. Or you can do bar, 4th, 5th, and 6th, and then use your middle finger or ring finger to do the 5th th uh, string 3rd fret. And wrap your thumb around to mute that. I just play it like this. D minor is you lift up the ring finger and use your index finger on the first fret bottom string. And finally, G. Third fret top string, second fret uh, second string, and then third fret sixth string. Those are pretty much all the chords you need. <clears throat> we can get into bar chords later. Hit me up. Alright, cool. Thank you. Uh, thank you for your time. This is coming up on 10 minutes right about now.